Are you ready for taking a boat ride? Where? There's no lake here, but we can pretend, we can imagine. And you can do boat ride with your siblings or your friend or your mom, your dad, your grandparents, whoever is at home with you, right? It's easy. You're sitting in your boat. It's going to be a pretend boat. Lift one leg up, lift the other leg up. Now, in the beginning, you might not be able to balance. You're welcome to put your hands down. But if you can balance, put your hand out, put the other hand out. This is the boat pose. Okay, let me show you one more time. So sit, sit down nice and straight, lift your one leg up, then the other leg up. If you can't balance, you're welcome to put your hands down. If you think you're nice and nice and strong, get your hands up. Because we need to get our oars. We are going in the ocean, are you ready? Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. That was great. Oh, I hear something. The phone is ringing. Ring, 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 ring. Ring, 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 ring. Who must be calling me, I wonder. But I don't have a phone. But I can pretend. This is my phone. Hello? It's my Pinnacle Presbyterian Preschool family. Hello, what are you all doing? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh, they all said hi to you. Okay, thank you. I think I'm gonna make a call. Let's make a telephone call. You pick one leg up, get your hand underneath, pretend this is your phone, dial the number. Ding, 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 ding. Ding, 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 ding. Ding, 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 ding. Hello? Uh-huh, uh-huh, that was our friend. Calling to find out how we are all doing. Oh, I'm so glad we got to talk with our friends with our telephone. That was great, wasn't it? Are you ready for more yoga? This time we are going to do some yoga. God, that is a little complicated. But I know you can do it. Do you know yoga was started millions of years ago in India? long long time ago a lot of words in yoga that's called Sanskrit that's an ancient language so in yoga they do the Surya Namaskar that means they salute the Sun isn't that amazing because Sun is here every day for us it gives us energy it helps our plants it helps us so we have got to say Namaskar to the Sun so Namaskar is salute and Sun is Surya are you ready for it? It's a little complicated, but I'll go step by step and I'm sure you can. Are you ready? Okay. We've got to be grateful to the sun. We've got to say thank you to the sun. Watch me. I'm going to go really slowly. So you come to the top of your mat. Your feet are a foot apart. Then you take your hands and you go all the way up slowly. Each time you have to breathe, okay? Hmm. Come up slowly, connecting. I can see the sun right there. Now I'm thanking you, the sun. Come slowly, slowly. This is called the swan dive. Slowly, slowly. Now if you're not very flexible, you can be here. If you think you can go down, take your time. You can touch your toes. That's really great. Take one foot back. Got that? Take the other foot back. Now you are a plank. You know a plank is nice and strong and sturdy. Look, I'm not even moving. My feet are nice and straight. My hands are nice and down. My shoulders are back and flat. I'm going to move slowly, slowly down. Then I'm pushing up straight like a cobra. Hold my toes just like that. Then I'm doing a downward facing dog. Just like this. Bring your foot in the front, then the other foot. Look up. Come up slowly. I'm looking at the sun. Hello, sun. Namaskar. That's the sun salutation. I'm going to do a chair pose. You're going to keep your legs. A little bit apart 
and you put your hands up in the air. Now you pretend there's a chair behind you. So you go right down, go, go, go. If you can only stretch this much, that's fine. If you can only sit this much and you want your legs to be at 90 degree, something like this. Not many people can sit like this, so you can be higher, you can go higher and higher, and we can practice, right? So let's try one more time. Take your hands up, come down slowly, pretend you're sitting. This is good, feeling really nice and strong. All the way down, come slowly, slowly up, slowly, slowly. You can do a double chair. Hold your friend's hand or your brother's hand or your sister's hand. Then you sit down and you sit down and you hold hands. And you can just play with each other, rock each other. Pretend I have a sister next to me, then slowly come up. You can do a double chair pose. Isn't that great?